Good morning, guys. So today we're going to our food tour, Little Havana, and then tonight we're going to a salsa class. I'm finishing my makeup. Um, my ears in the bathroom getting ready. So basically, y'all just gonna watch me kind of do the rest of my makeup because we're not running late, so we want to keep it that way. So finish my makeup and we're going. Let's go. in Miami and uh, it was lit it was too much going on it was very crowded so therefore we couldn't vlog um, you know I had my videographer and it was it would have been awkward to take out like a big camera with a flash to like get footage so fast forward to today we went to Sola Miami which was really good I had the shrimp alfredo it was delicious um, and then we went to um, our fragrance making class which was an Airbnb experience that was really good I got to make a fragrance it was a blend of ambergris, <laughs> I remember, uh, too, vanilla, and uh, what was my third one? What was my third one? What was my third one? I don't remember, but it was three. I had three. Oh, um, linden blossom, which I also had never smelled before. So I, I heard of ambergris, but I never smelled it. Um, I never heard of linden blossom. And of course, I've heard of vanilla. So I mix those three, and I have a really like soft, sultry. Um, fragrance so I'm really happy about that that experience was $69 I think and then I paid for a $20 surcharge because I wanted a bigger bottle of the travel size I mean of the of this perfume so the way it works is you there's a list of fragrances um, and you rate them like love like neutral or dislike and then you choose um, like how you want to mix your fragrances so you'll like smell them on these little tester strips and then you'll like put three together and then smell them and then add add or take away fragrances from there so that was really cool um i feel like i'm a perfume expert now and so now we're back at the airbnb um, i might go swimming later we might get some footage of that and then um yeah that wraps up my time in miami i will say this was very new for me um y'all know i travel alone i'm gonna be returning to that this was fun i really do love miami um when i come back I would come back, but like to do very specific things. Like I wouldn't go the nightlife route. I definitely wouldn't like go to clubs and shit here. Cause it's just, it's crazy. Um, we were gonna go out one night and I was just, um, I was trying to RSVP and it was like, oh yeah, it's 3,000 for a table. If you wanted to like RSVP and 2,000 for a tabletop. And it's just like, what? Like $2,000, $3,000, no. Um, and the two thousand dollar option wasn't even inside, so you would have been outside and subject to like the weather. So, if I were ever to come back to Miami, it would definitely be to do like cultural excursions. I would definitely do a, the salsa class was fun. I would definitely do another tour, food tour of Little Havana. I would do the perfume making class, and I would. We were supposed to do Jesse's today at five, but that got canceled. So we're just waiting on our refund for that. So I would more go that route instead of like the nightlife. I mean, it's the nightlife is jumping. But I'm just old. I'm old and I don't care. Like, I don't want to wait out outside and lines and shit anymore. Um, so, yeah, that's Miami. We're about to go out, go to the pool soon. Uh, to be honest, I'm completely tired. They want to go out. Uh, Jazz wants to go out and smoke hookah, so we may do that. But other than that, my time in Miami has come to an end. Um, I'm so ready to resume just traveling by myself. Like, I haven't traveled really by myself in over a year. So, I want to just get back into that and just traveling at a slower pace. So, um, my videographer is going to come with me to St. Louis. I won't be in St. Louis by myself. I'm going to be in St. Louis for work. But it'll just be me and him, like, going around doing all the cultural stuff, getting footage. Um, and that'll be, like, my return to <laughs> full-time solo travel. 
by myself as Black Girl World Traveler. I'm super excited about that. Um, so that trip is actually in September. So August, I'll be on hiatus. I'll be in like Wisconsin. So y'all won't see me there. But other than that, I will see y'all at the pool or at hookah or wherever. So